So today's video is going to be about the hidden items in Cerulean Cave. Now there's a lot of videos on YouTube that discuss the lit up areas on the main floor and that's it. But there are multiple other items inside the same cave that they are missing and not even informing you about. So I'm going to be walking you through the cave and showing you all the hidden item locations that I have found on all the floors. And hopefully you will find this video useful and be able to progress more efficiently through your gameplay. So stay tuned. Alright, so once you get inside the cave, you're just going to head north until you find the first ladder. You're going to go up there, and that'll take you to the main platform. Once you get up to the main platform, this is where everybody discusses in their YouTube videos about the hidden items. These lit up circles, right here, that's where you find the Ultra Ball, the Poke Ball, you can find 10 Ultra Balls. You can find master balls, berries, everything like that. You go to that crystal, you can find a dome fossil, helix fossil, old amber, or max revive. For the hidden items, you want to go over here to this ladder. You're going to go down. Sometimes whenever you come through here, the tail will start wagging on Pikachu. And there's a hidden item on the other side of that crystal. I'll get to that later on. We're going to go down that ladder. We're going to loop around here. We're just going to take this path. Sometimes there's an item over here by this first crystal. Max revive, fossils, that's what spawns here. It's random. I don't know what decides what pops up right there, but it's always a fossil or the max revive. So then you're going to continue around. Keep dodging all the Pokemon that you can. But none of these little circle lit up areas ever spawn anything for me at least I've never had anything spawn up except on the main platform now right here you can find another dome helix or old amber or max revive another place that has a hidden item is right across this water in which multiple videos have discussed this it takes you on the other side of where you find the Mewtwo and right up here at the top you will find a PP max and that just raises the max amount of times that you can use a move in a battle without having to recharge them up at a Pokestop. So now we just make our way all the way back through until we get back to the ladder. Just dodging Pokemon the entire way. So once you get up in this middle platform, you'll see the tail shaking. So this is how you get to. You go up this ladder, and then you come down here into this ladder right here. Now this takes you to the floor that you were just at, but now you're on the other side of that crystal. And right here is where you can find the rare candy. And by that time, Go back to these little circles and find more items because I think it goes by either steps or time but by the time you get back here you took enough steps to where there's more items generated in these lit up areas. So hopefully this is informing you about new things that you didn't know yet and hopefully it'll help you progress through the game more efficiently and you'll be able to make the most out of every trip inside this cave every day.